It's home to some of the most iconic car brands on the planet, but the electric vehicle market in Italy is still in its infancy. EV sales are way behind other European countries with much smaller populations, such as Portugal or Belgium. Plinio Vanini from Gruppo Auto Torino, which has more than 70 car dealerships across Italy, says his customers worry about two things in particular. Battery life is one of the main things. The second issue is charging infrastructure. The country is not ready yet, or it's not really adequate. Especially in cities, there are a number of complex issues. For example, the installation of charging boxes in apartment buildings, and therefore it's going to take a long, long time. Elon Musk's Tesla dominated the Italian market last year, with its models Y and 3 both outselling the electric version of Fiat's iconic Cinquecento or 500. Like in other parts of the world, EVs here are marketed as perfect for short journeys in busy cities. Two-seater electric vehicles like this one are becoming an increasingly common sight on the streets of the Italian capital. But their popularity could be down to something other than their green credentials. They're very small, so you can squeeze them into tiny parking spaces. And they're also exempt from strict traffic control measures in Rome's city centre. Chinese brands Jeku and Omoda are set to launch in Italy this year, but they're doing so at a tricky time. Last October, the European Commission launched an investigation into whether Chinese EV companies benefit from illegal state subsidies. This investigation will determine whether battery electric vehicle value chains in China benefit from illegal subsidization and whether this subsidization causes or threatens to cause economic injury to EU producers of battery electric vehicles. The Chinese government has described the investigation, which is still ongoing, as, quotes protectionist. As governments wait for the outcome, they're also trying to attract Chinese automakers to start building their cars in the EU. But after reports linking China's BYD to Italy, the company is now on the brink of building a factory in Spain instead. Giles Gibson for CGTN. Rome.